it's Kat and welcome back to another video on my channel. I hope that you enjoy it. I hope you find it helpful. About a week or two ago, I uploaded a video, five things that you forget to clean. And I asked you guys if you wanted to see another five and a lot of you guys said yes. And I'm so excited because I had more ideas. So I was hoping you'd want to see them so I could share those ideas with you. So that's what we're doing today. If you have not seen part one yet, I'll have it linked down below so you can go check that out. And if you want to see a part three, let me know in the comments if you like this kind of video and you want to see another five places that you forget to clean. And again, these are things that just when you're living your everyday life, you tend not to think about. I know I don't always think about these things until like I made mental notes to clean all these things every once in a while. So I hope this helps you out. I hope it makes your space nice and cleaner, nice and cleaner, nice and clean. Let's just get started before I mess up any more words. Number one is the vents in your room. And I feel like people like I never even thought of this, but they can accumulate a lot of dust on them. So once in a while, you just want to go through, dust them out so that when the air is blowing out of them, it's not blowing dust into your room. Number two also has to do with dust and dust bunnies, and that is under your bed, under your dresser, under your desk, under any shelves, anything that has an under, you wanna make sure that you're going through and vacuuming under there, maybe even mopping under there. I'd say like once every other week at least you're cleaning underneath your beds and underneath your beds, you probably only have one bed, underneath your bed, underneath your dresser, all that sort of stuff. Next is your robes. I know this is kind of a weird one, but I was thinking about it. I feel like I'm putting it on every morning. I only wear it for like half an hour or something while I'm getting ready for school or work. And then I just hang it back up in my closet and I never really wash it. But I'd say like every two weeks or every month, you should throw that in the washing machine. Next is your mirrors. And I thought of this because I was actually looking at my mirror and I was like, oh my gosh, that's so dirty. Like it looks gross. It, I can see dirt. Like it looks like there's dirt on my face, but the dirt's actually on the mirror. So I like to wipe them down every once in a while. It's really great. It's really great to get a nice clean on them. And I feel like when I clean a mirror and then I look at myself, I'm like, oh my gosh, that is so clear. Like it's crazy how well I can see every little piece of my face, which, you know, may not be like the bet. It's not always like, oh yeah, I can see every little pore on my face, but it is cool that it's super clean. <laughs> something that I know I forget to clean or I'll think like I have to clean this and then I don't end up doing it is your makeup brushes and your makeup like the packaging and stuff of your makeup I like to take a makeup wipe remover and use that to just give them a nice little clean it works perfectly because it removes makeup and a lot of times your makeup is messy from the other makeup that got on it so clean that off really quick and then of course make sure that you're washing your brushes because they're actually touching your face so you want to get any dirt and bacteria off of there all right guys I really hope you found this helpful if you want to see a part three of this let me know in the comments I like got closer to the camera because I'm so excited if you guys haven't seen part one you should definitely go check it out I'll have it linked somewhere here on the screen along with my cleaning and organization playlist so you can check all of those videos out if you enjoy them I think that's about it so I love you guys so so much and I love you and I'll see you in my next video bye that's my girl. That's my girl.